Hey James here. Today I'm just going to extend on the previous tutorial on Animate Pro Effects and I'm going to show how to add an effect to multiple drawing layers because I've been asked that and it's kind of something which isn't completely obvious. So I've just quickly drawn a couple of patches of smoke. I'm actually going to change my colour card to white. I think it'll demonstrate it a bit better. So I've got these two sort of patches of smoke. I'm just going to add some transparency to them. Simple as that. But you can see there's two separate layers. So if we go to our network view, it's a little bit ugly at the moment, so let's just clean this up. So we've now got two smoke layers and a tank. Now what you could do is you could add a transparency to each of these smoke layers to make it transparent. But, you know, this becomes problematic when you have six, seven of these or even more drawings that you want to all add the same effect to. So what you do is you go to your module library, you grab a composite, and this is like a group that you can group together all of your drawings and you can do this just to group them if you want or you can do it like I am for effects reasons. So I'm just going to call it composite smoke. So I know what it is, and I'm just going to drag this and this into the composite smoke, and I'm going to, and then you'll see now in the camera the smoke's disappeared. What I can then do is go to your net, you to connect this to the composite, and you'll see that it's back. But what we want to now do is grab a transparency and place it between the composite and our main composite, which will allow you to add the effect to both of these smoke layers. So. Let's grab a transparency and now you can see that they're transparent. So I really should stick something behind them so that we can clearly see that they're transparent. So maybe I'll do that and create another drawing. And we'll just make it Now this drawing has been created on the composite smoke, which was because I had one of those selected, so I'm just going to drag it out of it. And now you can see that yeah, this is indeed a little bit transparent. So what you can also do is you know add your multiple effects this way. So and there's something that might be nice is you might like to put a radial blur in as well. So if we look at the settings, or maybe blur it four. And now you can see we've got some blur on these two. So that's that's basically how you add multiple effects to draw multiple drawings to effects in Animate Pro. Hope this helps someone.